Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So today we have an unboxing. I've uh, cut the sides so we can have a look and see what's inside. So this is exciting. This is uh, my promotion box from Craft Buddy. So full disclosure, I have received these products free, but I will give an honest review on them. Okay, so let's have a look and see what we've got. Right, that's my invoice. You don't need to see that one. Okay, look at this. Oh, I think we have a bit of a theme going here. So we've got a DIY crystal art keyring set. That looks really good. We've got a toucan. That looks like a panda and a turtle. Oh, I love turtles. Okay, so we'll have a closer look at that one. That looks really good. Mmm, key rings. Always oh, need key rings. All right, this is the, um, at the time of making this video, um, this is the Craft Buddy promotion that they've got on at the moment. If you spend £20, um, you get this sticker kit free. And it's brilliant. To be fair, I have had this sticker kit um, a couple of years back um, and it's fantastic. The brilliant ones to done up. So, yeah, we've got our jungly theme there as well. And, uh, yeah, okay, so we'll have a closer look at those. But, yeah, if you pop on to um, www.craftbuddyshop.com um, and have a look there, you will, if you spend £20, have this added into your order. So, that's nice. Yeah, quite big stickers, those as well. Really good. Okay, and look at this. It's some giraffes. Oh, wow. Look at those. That is uh, super. Can't wait to get this done. Okay, let me just put this box out of the way. More boxes for the recycling. <laughs> okay, so giraffes. Yeah, I've got fond memories with giraffes. Um, we went, ooh, before uh, Hubby got poorly, um, we went with my brother and sister-in-law to Windsor Safari Park down south. Uh, that's down south in uh, England. Um, and we saw some giraffes there and they were absolutely gorgeous. There were some baby ones as well. So, yeah, uh, you could um, do some feeding with them, but unfortunately we weren't there long enough to feed them. But yeah, that was fab. Okay, so it comes in your smashing little uh, craft buddy box, which as I say, I love these boxes because it always feels like a present. And if it's for you, then you've bought yourself a present and it's lovely boxed which always makes it extra special okay so create your own beautiful crystal art uh, we've got one framed adhesive, adhesive canvas two trays two crystal pickup pens one jelly wax instruction manual and crystal storage bags okay so yep it's a full crystal and it's 30 by 30 and these do come pre-framed which always saves you a job of looking for a frame um, you can just put them straight on the wall once they've done so that's always a bonus again you've got your contents on the back there you've got your uh, instructions in your four different languages and then you've got your social media details your facebook group there and uh, your facebook group this is one which is the craft buddy crystal at um, facebook and then there is a group with over ten thousand members which it's great to join it's lovely there um, I'll put a link down below for you, so if you want, do want to join, you can see yeah, lots of different crystal art stuff there, um, and they're a real friendly bunch as well. Okay, so let's get into this box and have a look at this canvas. Oh, look at these, my nails are in a terrible state. Uh, you may be pleased to know Hubby is home from hospital. Um, he's been over home just over a week now so I've been doing a lot of diamond painting but I've not had a chance to film I've been having to stay with him um, and make sure he's okay because you know he needs a lot of help at the moment he's very very weak after four weeks in hospital so yeah but anyway I'm pleased he's home and it's great so put our box there out of the way okay so nicely bagged up here we've got our schematic legend here um, and it's all letters as you can see that I'll take it out of the bag and show you properly uh, A to Z there and we've got DMC numbers which is yay that's marvellous so I can put this in my drill storage okay let's have a look at this cameras look at those cute little faces little noses and I love the little horns on the top 
you're a strange animal, aren't the giraffes? They seem to do a bit of everything all mixed in together. With a great big long neck. I've got a really short neck, so <laughs> I can't wear necklaces and things very well. <laughs> I look like I'm being choked. Okay, lovely pack of drills there. So yeah, you get your uh, basic toolkit and um, it's got uh, your two pens there, your two three places, which you can put your pink wax in there. Look if you can see that. Are you showing up camera? That's it, you can see. Just put your pink wax in the end there. You can pick up to three uh, drills at once with that one. Excuse my nails. Um, you get your two little pots of wax. There's two boats there to put your gems in. And you get about 20 bags, which is brilliant because you can put all your spare drills in those um, as you're going along if you wish. I like to kick mine up and put them in little boxes um, if you've seen my previous videos. Um, so, yeah, that's one of the pens from their set. And I've just put a couple of squishes on it just to make it a bit easier to hold. I'm getting old and I can't hold things as I did. <laughs> okay, so we'll pop the toolkit over there. You get your instruction leaflet there, which is super. Yep, telling you how to diamond paint again in four different languages. So we're a multinational at Craft Buddy. Okay, pop that out of the way. Now, um, if you're wanting to send these away as kits, I mean, they're well packaged, so, you know, they're going to get there in one piece. Um, let's have a look at this uh, schematic then. So we've got A, B, C, D, F, G. Ooh, M and M are similar colours there, so I'll have to watch that one. Um, sometimes you can get a little bit muddled, but we'll see where they're clear. But to be fair, the drill fields are usually pretty good on these got an X, P and R are completely different, um, D and B are different colours, so it's just possibly an M and M that I'll, M and M, <laughs> I won't start singing, uh, it's a nice day here, we don't want it to rain, uh, so yeah, I'll have to watch out for those, but other than that, lovely clear uh, drill field there, so yeah, so that's your uh, key code, so all these different letters correspond to your different packets of drills, um, as to where you put your beads. So you can just snip that off the back. I like to keep this um, and I photocopy it and put photocopies of these on my boxes. I will do a boxing up of this so you can see how I do with that if you've not seen it before. But yeah, uh, you can just use those on your boxes if you wish or just keep that as like a walking legend, you know, next year while you're painting. But to be fair, I'm good at losing things so I always like to make copies of everything just in case. Okay, so let's have a look at this drill field. Wow, look at that. Oh, look at those faces. Look at those eyes. Wow, let's say this is full drill. So you can have different colours in the eyes. If Oh, look at that little face. It's smiling, smile. You know, it's having its photograph taking that one, I think. So let's just have a look and see where the M and the N are. See if they're anywhere near. M, 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 M. Go on everybody, oh there's N look, so that's like the grey there, and M, oh look, they're, they're, I don't know if you can see that, they are really quite a different colour. So yeah, we're not going to have any problems with muddling up, other than if you decide you've picked up the wrong colour and start drilling with the wrong colour like I did the other night. But hey ho, that was because I was tired. But there's no uh, guide circles, training circles on this, so... You need to put your drill out exactly over the letter, but it means that there's nothing showing on the edges, so that's great. But yeah, oh, I love that. Look at those faces, smiley giraffes. Wow, okay, I think this is going to be the next one I do. I have just completed one, um, so I think I might do this one next. Yeah, bit of a jungle thing. Okay, so let's have a look now. Look at the drills. Got the to crinkling. See if I can... I can never get into these packets. If anybody's got a brilliant way of getting into these packets and finding which way they are, let me know because I'm absolutely hopeless. Okay, so throw that away. Look like crinkly packets. Right, how many colours have we got on this? Did it say how many colours we have? No, let's have it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty, forty, fifty. 30, 40, 50 23, 23 colours. Okay, so it will have fit in our little 28 case. So that's good. Oh, we could always put it in our fancy bottle case. 
because there is quite a lot of the girls in this one. So oh, that's said, so we'll start at the other end. Okay, it all seems to be a back to front and upside down these, or maybe it's just me. And you, I tend to work from the left for some reason. Okay, so we have, I'm not going to tell you the DMC codes on these. Um, we've got yellow, which is a lovely eggy yellow. Oh, I love that green. It's like a oh, limey green, I think. Grey there, that's your browns for all you can. Oh, look at all those browns. You've got four there, so that'll be like contrast on your giraffe. And then all your greens, look, more greens to contrast on your leaves and your background. Got some creamy colour there as highlights, like a beige colour. A grey, oh, look, more browns. Wow, look at all those browns. This is what I like about craft buddy. It, they do enclose a lot of different colours and there's a lot of thought gone into uh, making these pictures so that they come out to the best that they can do with all the shading. I can't get a hold of that. But yeah, I think you get the idea. Look how many browns there are. I mean, this is only a 30 by 30 picture. Ooh, there's a lot of that colour. What's that one? X. X, Y and Z are the ones with the most colour. So X is, oops, 3371. All right, okay. And then 3866 and Z is 5200, which is your lovely, brilliant bright white, which looks like Z sort of the highlights around the edges. So yeah, so that's lovely. Ooh, that's uh, like a really deep brown colour. I don't know if I've used that one before. If you looked at that quickly you would think that is black but uh, no it's not and there isn't actually any three tens in this one no blacks mm, that's good as well okay so let me pop this one out the way and we'll have a look at our other goodies and see what else we've got okay give me a second right so let's have a look at our key rings next so, can see some eyes looking at me there. Ooh, boggly eyes. I see those. Ooh, just peering out. I've never had a canvas look at me like that before. Okay, so we've got um, our little toolkit again, which again has your three placer. And as I say, most kits have about 20 bags in. Um, I've not sat and counted them, so if there's one more or one less or whatever, uh, don't come after me. <laughs> okay, so that's your little toolkit. Oh wow, these are bigger than I expected as well. Okay, so you've got your little uh, instruction sheet there which tells you what you've got in your set. Uh, and again, your instructions. So yeah, great. And again, I mean, these would be great for uh, younger children. I say this says eight plus, but uh, I'll insert a picture down below. Uh, my granddaughter, who is six, has been diamond painting this week. She's been doing some little animals similar to this, but not key rings. So, and I think uh, my stickers might end up going that way as well, but we'll see. Maybe we'll sit when we're lockdown's finished. I'm hoping grandchildren will be able to come and we can give them hugs and we can sit and craft and we can have lots of fun again because we've really missed out this year. Okay, so, oh, I can see a big sparkly there. Wow. Let's have a look at these. Okay. So we've got two packs of beads. Ah, oh, I see. So how are we going to know which one is which or are they all the same? Let's have a look at these. Okay, let's take these out. Crinkly packets. So we have one, two, three of your like bag charm keychains. So you can use those. Uh, to hang on your handbags and um, put your keys on there. This is like a big clip one. Um, I can't remember what they're called now. The snake clip? No, not snake clip. Uh, anyway, somebody will tell me. Uh, and then these are your clasp clips that you can keep things really safe on. And then you've got some little chains as well. Actually, um, you could use these if you wanted to hang them as charms from your mobile phone. You've got your little chains there in place of or you can use those on another project so that's good you've got a choice on these as to what you do with them so let's have a look at these oh look at the little panda now they are yours so it's entirely up to you what colors you put on them if you don't want him as a panda it doesn't have to be a panda 
and they are double sided so and then you just have your plastic if i can get my nail underneath yeah just have your plastic there that lifts up like your canvases and this is all sticky here uh, oh, i've dropped it <laughs> i've dropped it down i'm thinking that's not sticky oh dear liz what are you like so yeah that's all sticky there um, and that's where you put all your drills what i would recommend with these is do all one side first and then do the other side um if you try doing both at once you tend to find that the drills do move or they do for me anyway um, <laughs> yes yeah, so there's little guide circles on it and with these being acrylic um i would try and do it uh, when you're drilling do it from up above rather than doing them on a slant um, i tend to do them on a slant and then when i put them straight i think oh those drills out on straight <laughs> um so yeah i would try and just work maybe on a table a flat surface or something with these but uh, you'll find your own way of doing them you, you'll know how best to do them once you get started but yeah so that's your little teddy let's have a measure where's my tape measure gone see show you how big these are so they are bigger than i expected which is great so we'll go from the ear there down to there so that's about seven centimeters which is about two and three quarter inches so they're quite good and then that way we're about just under two inches just about four and a half centimeters nearly five centimeters so yeah good size that one okay and then we have our turtle lovely clear drill field again all different color got all the different colors on that I mean that is one little pendant there and that is really sweet and again double-sided oh these are really nice they're nice if you've been doing a bigger canvas um or you've just got five minutes and you think i just want to do something then you can just uh, sit and do one of these probably about 20 minutes half an hour to get them done uh, maybe a bit longer there's no race with drill uh, with that uh, diamond painting you just got your own pace and uh, nobody's going to come after you if it doesn't take you the time that you think it should so that one is about six and a half centimeters which is about two and a half inches that way so a lovely size and it's about seven centimeters that way which is about two and three quarter inches that so yeah lovely and then this one this one's going to be really nice and colorful look at that looks like he's got some shapes on him as well with his feathers that's a, a toucan okay and he's double-sided i'm just thinking it was guinness wasn't it that used to have a toucan <laughs> mm. okay so it can be difficult to measure this one but from tip of his beak to the tip of his tail that's four inches which is about 10 centimeters and his widest part well about two inches five centimeters on his beak um and is about four centimeters which is about one and three quarter inches that way so they're lovely well, yeah really good really nice quality as well good thickness nice acrylic let's just see if we can i don't know if it'll pick this up see you're about 20 millimeters so about a fifth of a centimeter in the, the size there if you can see yeah so very good quality very nice so let's have a look at these and see what we're all right we've got two lots of s look oh i see we've got smaller ones and bigger ones so you can decide whether you want small eyes or big eyes on your panda or of course you could just put if you've got any big gems you could just put those on if you don't want the googly eyes on okay so let's have a look at these we only get with two lots of drills do i think let's have a look mm, there's an awful lot of drills in here let's see so I do believe we may have. Goodness me, look at all the drills in this. So that's. Nope, they're all. Gosh, what have we got? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Oh no, they're the same. Ah, right. So yeah, we've got duplicate drills there. That's confused me. 
Yeah, we have. We've got duplicate. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, right. Oh, I'll get in touch with uh, Craft Buddy and say you've sent me duplicate drills here. See if they want them back. But yeah, so we've got two lots of drills. Oh, there's an awful lot for these little key rings, but and you never know. Okay, so two lots of drills in that one. Okay, so possibly then. They are definitely different sizes, those eyes. But yeah, so we've got two lots of eyes. We've got an extra one there as well. That's a big eye. Make them into a cyclops. <laughs> Let's have a look at these drills. Wow, they're all the crystals. They're all the gems. So we've got silver and gold and greens and like a deep lime green there and an orange. And that's like a brown colour. Look at that colour. That's a different colour. Wow, look at that. Those colours. I don't think I've seen that one before. That's like a brown with like a fiery purpley red in it. Very nice. I wonder where that one goes. What's, what's that one? That's H. I wonder if that one's... Where's H? Come out, come out. Ooh, that one's on the toucan. Look, that's going to go around the edges on the toucan. So that's going to highlight the feathers. Oh, that's going to look super. I like that idea. And we've got, yeah, that's your black there. There's no DMC codes with this. Um, but yeah, oh, look. And then there's another one there. Look, that's the green. That's got like a, an AB coat in there, which is uh, super there. Yeah, so that'll be the turtle. That one is K. Yep, so that's the highlights on the turtle shell there. Okay. And then our special shapes. Wow. Oh, that one's got a green one that's coming in. So these are all our special shapes. Oh, I've got some of my favourites. Look at those. They're like a half sphere. And they've got uh, like an AB greeny bluey coating on all of those. And then, oh, we've got one great big spark there. I wonder what that one's for. I wonder where that one's come from. Um, I can't see where that, I wonder if that one's escaped from another kit, look it's made a break for freedom, but I do like that, I will definitely be putting that to use, mm. and then some little round green ones, so yeah they're going to be really sparkly once they're done, love those, okay and we've got a bonus there with two lots of drills, but as I say I will contact Craft Buddy uh, and see if they do want those back, right let me just put these away and I'll be back with you in a second. Okay, and let's just have a quick look at these stickers then. Um, there are lots of pictures on the Craft Buddy, um, Craft Buddy Facebook page and the Craft Buddy uh, group if you want to go and have a look at these and see them done. Oh, got a white pen in this one. I do like the white ones because I fill them up with uh, my sparkly gems. You've seen me do that before, I like to just... And then when the end comes off, you can change it for a different colour if you're feeling, but I've got hot pink in mind. <laughs> okay, and you bought me wax, so there's just enough to do there. This is great for anybody that's just starting out, just give them something to do. I've got diamond painting. As I say, I think these may end up going to my uh, little granddaughter, or one of them. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten stickers there. Lovely theme, goes with my giraffes and my toucan and my turtle. Not quite sure where the panda fits in, but we'll pretend that the panda's a jungle theme. I suppose it is a jungle in a way. Anyway, Liz, stop waffling. So we've got cherries, we've got some flowers, cheese plant leaf there. Nice piece of melon, a big leaf there. So, you know, you can make your own little designs. You've got a lovely butterfly there. And that looks like a cocktail in a half of a coconut. Oh, I could just drink one of those at the moment. Okay, and your cockatoo, is it, with his uh, crest on there, flamingo, and another toucan, definitely a toucan theme going on. So it is just the stickers that are, uh, I've got the sticky on, and they're just an extra layer look, and they are transparent as well, these stickers, if you can see, you can see through there, yeah. So when you put them onto something, you're not going to get any white background. Um, let me just show you. Let's show, show you the two pan. Look, I'll just carefully peel him up there. Oops. You can see there, look, it's transparent. So you will just get the two can 
uh, any little fronds or feathers or whatever on the top of his head you won't get all the white background so you can put them onto wherever you like notebooks um, I noticed quite a few uh, little mask boxes are coming out these days and they're quite plain so you could put one of these onto your mask box but you would need to seal them if they're going in and out of handbags or whatever but if you're just using them for cards you wouldn't need to so let's have a look how many colours have we got here one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve sixteen colours so we have lots of nice pinky colours which will be flamingo I would think we've got your black which will be your toucan your greens Lovely bright red there. Oh, look at that. That's a real deep blood red, that one. And silver, like an ambery gold. And then like a silver with a grey top to it. And then we have like a greeny, really pale greeny silver there. Like another yellowy gold colour. A couple of blues. Oh, they're nice blues. And a real yellow, bright yellow. And then a brown colour. But yes, so great for a little. You can buy these if you wish. Um, I think they're normally about nine ninety nine. And I apologise if you watch this video late, um, and the offer's not on anymore. But at the moment, bank holiday, May, beginning of May, bank holiday weekend, then these stickers are available, uh, and we'll be putting your order if you spend twenty pound on the website. Okay, so we've had uh, two cans, we've had key rings, and we've had a bag giraffes <laughs> Put that down there. there you are make a little display there you are that's our jungly theme okay so thanks for watching if you've liked the video then please please press that like button down below and if you want to see a bit more if you press the subscribe button down in this corner and um, there is a bell next to it so you'll be notified of any videos that come up and uh, i hopefully i'll see you all again soon bye for now